Hi, my name's Liz Hurley, and I ha my Etsy shop is elizabethhurley.etsy.com, and today I'm going to show you how to stretch designer fabrics onto a canvas stretcher like this, um, so that you can hang up, just do some wall hangings with decorative fabrics. So what you're going to need is four canvas stretchers like this, uh, which you can get at any arts and crafts store. Um, Michael's um, or Hobby Lobby I think is the cheapest from what I found so the most affordable um, and then you'll need a hammer and a nail gun the first thing you do is put these together like this you'll put all four together and then use the hammer to make sure that it's completely square at that point you'll have something like this and you'll need to cut the fabric that you want um, a good two inches wider than the canvas is a, a good amount to use. So this is an eight by eight and the fabric is 12 by 12. So what you do is lay it on top, flip it over, and then when you stretch it, you're gonna wanna go in a circle. So you're gonna start by taking the staple gun and then go to the opposite side, pull, and so on. And as you go, you'll be making it tighter and tighter so that you'll have a good um, tension around it. So, so you just keep doing that. And now I'm going to show you how to do a corner. So what you'll do is go like this, pull it this way, and then bend it so that it's folded like this and then fold it over like that. And if you're using a thicker fabric, what you can also do is cut this corner off a little bit so it doesn't get too bunched up. So it's kind of like making a bed. So you just fold it in, tuck it under, and then fold it over like this. And then you pull it tight and then what you'll have is a nice finished corner like that. When you're all done, it'll look something like this. And then you can hang the two fabrics or however many you want to do together to make a wall piece. This is one of the pieces that I've embroidered on top of um, a fabric. And if you want to, if you don't want the back to look like this, you can hot glue felt to the back, which is what I do, and then I've installed. A, um, something to hang it on. And then that's what it would look like. Okay, thank you.